Hey, what's up? <laughs> okay, so trying to figure this damn thing out. Man, I ended up hitting the button and messed it up. So anyway, this is your boy TJ for Prosper Mobile. I'm gonna get it here. This is take two. Man. All right. So like I did last update, um, I want to start this off by apologizing to a family member that uh, my last update I. Uh, just got involved in the situation here in my home and uh, I ended up venting and putting some stuff out that I really I shouldn't have done. Um, for the most part, even though that person denied it, I'm pretty sure I, I offended that person. And uh, and I know you're watching this right now, so I am sorry. The most I can do is learn from that mistake and not do it again. So And that's a good thing because now I'm gonna try to be a little more careful with the things I say and I put up and things I do on uh, my uh, my channel here. So this is all about respect and appreciation. I mean, I should have done what I done. I should. And to a point, if anything, I just might have taken that video down because you know, like, yeah, it is what it is. So to that person, I'm sorry, dude. Uh, so if any other family members got a hold of this, I'm pretty sure because <laughs> that stuff just man goes like wildfire. Um, I apologize for that, but you know it. it you guys know my frustrations. For those who are family, close family, you know what's going on. Yes, I shouldn't have put it out for everybody to watch, but it is. I did, so all right, squashed. All right, so right now I'm in the process of moving. Um, so this home, this is actually going to be the last update that I do here. Um, probably from here on in, so I can get situated and get my own laptop and be doing stuff for my phone. <laughs> yes, this. So it's not going to be done. So that's the way it is. Um, as you see, I, I think I do because I feel good. I, I got up really early and, and I got washed up and got you know packed up and everything. And, and I look happy. I, I feel really good right now. Uh, so I'm I'm excited about what's going to eventually happen with this new place I'm moving to. Um, here, cool place, but truth is that it's hard to get a job, and especially it's hard to get to that job because we are in a rural country right now. And um, it's just hard to, you know, get back and forth and whatever. So, but where I'm moving, this uh, few jobs I'm trying to get, I could literally seriously walk to work. Awesome. Or even ride a bike to work or whatever I choose, but I can get to work. Not a problem. And uh, that's what I'm excited about. I'm actually going to get on that. That's a good thing. i like to thank my parents. Again, my mom's not going to watch this unless I post this on my Facebook, and she probably will, but... I would like to thank you and your husband <laughs> for uh, for putting up with me for six months. Thank you, I appreciate it. I really do appreciate it. I still love the guy, you know. That's just something I can't change. I don't particularly care for certain people in general, but you know, you can't just cut off that. That uh, he is a good people, so you know, he helped me out when I needed it, and as well as you, my mom, he helped me out when I needed it, and my siblings, they helped me out when I needed it, and I really appreciate that because you know. A lot of people can't do that. They they leave one situation, and uh, that's when they're screwed. And my phone is acting weird. So I'm really lucky when it comes to that because for those who don't know, um, six months ago I basically left Colorado. My wife and I broke up, and we're in the midst of getting divorced here within this this month ish, next month ish, and it's going to be final. So that was something in 16 years of my life that I was involved with with this person being, you know, um, pampered and whatever. And now I'm coming over here and it's all on me for the most part because I have, because I have my family help me out. But, you know, it's that that family. That's what I really appreciate and I'm very thankful for. So process of rebuild myself, rebuild my self-esteem, my confidence, and hopefully get myself on my feet. Right now I'm, I'm still on my hip and my ass, but I'm trying. I'm trying my best to roll over and try to stand up and it's hard but I got to do people behind me, I got a good support system behind me and it's going to work out, it will work out, I will make it work out, it has to work out <laughs> so it's good stuff and uh, that's where I'm at right now I'm actually like I said, I'm moving, I can see behind me some of my clothes I was going to lift the thing up so you can see the rest of my stuff but I ain't touching this because I don't want to mess it up and uh, that's just, you know, that's what I'm going right now. So I'm basically waiting patiently. And uh, here with him later today, I'll probably do another update, let you guys know where I'm at. And I'm uh, just going to looking forward to it. Um, where I'm going to be moving at, the person is a fitness guru. He likes to work out. And I, as you can see, this is disgusting. 
I I absolutely hate the way I look. I'm 205 pounds right now, and I'm just a slob. I, I hate it. Um, and I even try to pull myself, call myself an athlete, even though I still perform as a wrestler. Uh, with this much body weight, it's, it's pathetic. So hopefully I can end up changing and lose some weight. Get down to about 175, 180. Should be good. For my height, 5'6", five, 5'7". Five, I think that'll work out. So it's a good thing. So looking forward to it. And I've uh, been out here, what, five and a half minutes. I just want to get in here and let you guys know and apologize to some of the people that I pinned with my prior um, update, which will possibly end up being took down. I think I'll probably do that. So. But then again, if I do take it down and you guys see this, you'll be like, what the hell is he talking about? <laughs> so, yeah. Um, yeah. I'm just looking around. It's kind of hard to believe. I've been here for six months now. I'm not going to be here anymore. But, you know, it, life goes on. Life moves on. And this is just part of my life that's going to eventually happen. I was with that Colorado now. I'm over here and doing my thing. So. But you guys know um, I'm gonna try to start more doing more updates on my TJ Tapua uh, channel, and uh, just try to interact and just get a little more serious. So, anyways, I'm about to go. I know you guys are saying about freaking time, <laughs> but anyways, peace, chicken grease. I will definitely try to get on here and uh, do some more updates. Okay, in closing, just because I'm curious and it just popped in my head and I want to do it for. Um, Jason Renfro, yes, I may have said your name, as well as Mark Taylor. Hoping you guys will be able to check these updates out whenever you have a chance. Uh, you guys up here the has been for yes, um, have been MIA for a while. Hit me up. And what's going on? You know, so see how it works out. I'm not really far from Jersey. I'm like hella far from Texas, but you know, it's all good. I can make a trip eventually. Now that I'm single and I don't have to worry about the old lady, you know, yelling at me. <laughs> So, uh, anything there, babes? Peace.